In this example, we're going to take 2w plus 3, and we're going to square it. So we can do this one of two ways. You'll see I've written a formula over here where we have a binomial, and it's a perfect square, where we can square the first term, a squared, and we can take twice the product of the two terms, so 2 times a times b, and then finally square the second term and add them all together. So we can use the formula, which we'll do here in a second. Or you can go ahead and just put them side by side, 2w plus 3 times 2w plus 3, because when you're squaring something, aren't you just multiplying it by itself? So we could do this and then distribute it through. So let's go ahead and see what this one looks like first, and then we can use the formula, and I'll show you how it kind of simplifies it a little. So 2w times 2w makes 4w squared, and then 2w times positive 3 is plus 6w, and then 3 times 2w is another 6w, and then 3 times 3 is 9. So look carefully at these terms. Where do they come from? Well, the 4w squared was the 2w squared right there, and the 9 was the 3 squared, so that was the first term and the last term being squared. And these middle two terms, they're both the same, so you could say twice 6w, okay? Well, if you have 2 times 6w, where the 6w come from? Well, it's because we multiplied the 2w and the 3. So it's twice the product of the two terms. So what we really end up with is 4w squared plus 12w plus 9. So that's what that product will look like. Let's go ahead and use this formula, and we'll see it's the exact same thing. So we have a squared, so 2w squared, which is 4w squared, and then twice the product of the 2, so 2 times 2 times 3, and then throw your w in there, so plus 12w, and then the square of the last one, 3 squared is 9. And of course you see uh, they're exactly the same. So whichever one you're more comfortable with is perfectly fine. Since we're squaring this binomial, you can either put them side by side and multiply them out, or if you can remember this formula, and that's pretty easy to do as well, just go ahead and use that formula. Either way, you'll get the same product.